Hey guys, it's Rick and I'm back here with part 12 of my collection series, these being the K titles. This video should be a relatively quick one as I do not have a ton here. Uh, some DVDs, most of which are a TV series and are all connected to the same person. Uh, and the rest Blu-rays, so let's dive right in. The first title is Kevin James, Sweat the Small Stuff. Um, this DVD is very reminiscent for me of high school, my good friend Seth. Him and I watched this, and uh, a lot of the bits he does on this were on King of Queens, but some of it was just ridiculously funny to us, and we would quote it all the time, like uh, telephone rhythm and the line at a bank, and it's very funny. If you haven't seen it, Kevin James Sweat the Small Stuff, very cool. And the rest of what I have on DVD, King of Queens 1, 2... Three, four, I'm sure you guys are noticing a trend. Five, still sealed. Six, still sealed. <laughs> Seven, still sealed. Eight, still sealed. And for some reason, nine, open. Uh, I love King of Queens. I don't know if I ever watched the finale of it. Like, I don't remember. It did lose steam towards the end of the run. Um, so... It's a funny show. I really like it. I'm glad I own it. I wish there was a more condensed version of it. I know they have that big like delivery truck one and that's cool if I had more room to display it, but I don't. So for now, keeping it in that format is fine. The last time I do have on DVD, once again, connected to King of Queens and Kevin James is a four year consideration Emmy disc for King of Queens. It's pretty cool. I don't own um, anything else like this. So it's from 2004. Very cool. King of Queens for your consideration disc. I really like it. It's, it's neat to own something like this for a show that I really enjoy. It's Blu-ray time, guys. The Karate Kid 1 and 2 box set. Keanu with Key and Peel. The Kevin Smith 3-pack with Chasing Amy, Jay and Silent Bob Strike Back, and Clerks. Kick-Ass with the slipcover as the movie's falling out. Kick-Ass 2. Very cool. These are probably two of my favorite steelbooks I own. And that is Kill Bill Volume 1 and Kill Bill Volume 2. I really love the artwork on that. Both still factory sealed. Uh, Kill Bill, amazing movie. Um, so, volume one and volume two. Uh, really cool to own those on Steelbook. I definitely, I'd love to have a Tarantino like marathon week where I watch all his stuff. Um, my girlfriend Bridget's into his movies as well. I don't think she's seen The Hateful Eight yet. Uh, I haven't seen Jackie Brown yet, so. It would be cool to watch everything um, from start to finish. Next, a movie I don't know a ton about, but it has a great cast with Kate Hudson, Jessica Alba, Casey Affleck, and that is The Killer Inside Me. If you guys have seen this or know about it, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think. Uh, I don't know much about that. I'm sure I got it super cheap. It looks like the artwork was wet at some point. Steelbook of Killing Them Softly with Brad Pitt. We got the King Kong Steelbook, this being the, uh, what year was this put out, 05? The Jack Black King Kong. Comedy classic right here. Kingpin with Randy Quaid, uh, Bill Murray, Woody Harrelson, Vanessa Angel. Super funny, classic movie in my opinion. Uh, the Fairly Brothers movie. Then, uh, some of my favorite modern films if you will on um, one of one of the best modern series in my opinion uh, kingspin yeah kingspin i had kingpin on the brain the kingsman the secret service kingsman the secret service steelbook and kingsman the golden circle I really enjoy the Kingsman movies. I think they're very funny. I love the action sequences in those movies as well. Next, Night and Day with Tom Cruise and Cameron Diaz. 
Knock Knock with Keanu Reeves. Another classic, Knocked Up, Seth Rogen, uh, Catherine Heigl, Jonah Hill, Martin Starr, Jason Segel, uh, who else is in this from the crew? Leslie Mann, Paul Rudd, Jay Baruchel. Just, it's an awesome movie. It's so funny. It holds up so well. Uh, then we have Kong Skull Island with the slipcover with some stuff all over it. Cool, 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 cool. Krampus, one of the few modern horror movies that I actually own in my collection. And then bizarrely, last but not least, Kung Fu Panda 3. I do not own Kung Fu Panda 1 and 2, surprisingly. So I will have to be on the hunt for those. Uh, they should be relatively inexpensive. I should be able to get them for a few dollars each on Blu-ray. So this way I have the trilogy. And that's it, guys. This is definitely probably the fastest video uh, in this collection series. I might go for a fifth video tonight just so I'm good for probably a few weeks unless I do like an unboxing or a pickup video. Um, I might try to go for one more. I have to see. L looks to be like about almost a shelf of Blu-rays so I might do that. Uh, but that's not your concern. You guys will see that video probably in like three days to a week. So that's it, guys. Uh, be sure to check out all my stuff in the description box down below, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Hit the like button, subscribe. Be sure to hit that notification bell. And until next time, who's down the movie?